Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Lillian Mabine. If you're new, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you're just watching and tuning in from Instagram, I'm super excited to have you here. I'll leave my handle here for you guys below if you haven't checked it out. Because the items I'm going to be showing with you guys, I will be styling throughout the week. So the purpose of this video is, you guys, I watch styling videos all the time. I'm obsessed with them. I love fashion. If you didn't know, I designed clothes for 10 years. So it's long overdue that we do these styling videos with Lillian's take on it, I guess. I'm going to share with you five coats that I'm obsessed with that I got and five coats that are perfect for winter. Why you need each piece, whether it's black one, camel one. I kind of want to show you guys what they look like and what I look for. And I want to make sure that I show you guys highs and lows. If I buy a coat that has more of a splurge price point, the top needs to be a little bit more average. I'm all about mixing it up. So I'm excited to start these videos with you guys. And let's just jump into the first one. The first coat looks like this. I got this in New York. It's actually still available. I just checked for you guys. If you already didn't know, I am obsessed with Zara because there's certain coats that they have based on price points. This is a black one. Every girl needs a staple black coat. But the cool thing about this one is it has gold metal closures and it adds a bit of a flare to it and it has pockets as well. The notched collar, you can fold it up when you're cold. It warms up your neck and it's more of a fitted look. I'll throw it on for you guys to show you guys how it looks on the body and what I wear. But this is for more of a splurge. And the reason why is it's, I think, about $200 and it's 75% wool. And something I want to tell you guys about wool, wool is a natural fiber. Natural fibers are more expensive than synthetic and man-made fibers because they last longer. So anytime you look and you want to buy something and you want to invest in especially a black coat that can be durable for many seasons, you want to be able to invest in a timeless piece. You want to make sure that the quality is not polyester and that it lasts throughout each season. And when I got this, I know that it was a higher steep point. I wanted to make sure the quality I invested in was a good one and that's going to last throughout seasons. 75% wool. And it's something that I learned while I was in school is 75% wool. Each wool fabric, it traps air pockets more better. So in the cold, it holds better. It's more durable and it keeps you warmer, which is why wool and cashmere and like merino wool is always more expensive. So if you're investing in it, it is going to be a piece like this. This one has gold buttons as well. Somewhere here. <laughs> It's right here. Something like this with gold buttons can be dressed up. It could be dressed down. I kind of wear it with a nice coat, but I could throw it on with like pleather leggings, jeans. It looks like an elevated timeless piece. And you can find one, but when you button it up, it just looks absolutely chic. Perfect piece for winter. What was that information? <laughs> Just keep rolling. I'm going to get into the second coat for you guys. Romel was telling me he was learning a few things from me. But the second coat is a camel coat. Now, if you're following me on Instagram again, I'll leave my handle below. Because lately, that's all I've been obsessed with. I've been dressing it with black. I mean, I can't get enough of this. So this one is from Ralph Lauren. It's a classic staple piece. This one is a splurge. So what I'll do is I'll link a more affordable version for you guys in the description box below. I'll also link direct links for each items that I've gotten because they're still available. This one is 90% virgin wool and 10% cashmere. This is like the creme de la creme, the whipped cream, cherry on top when it comes to fabrication for winter. This is something that you know that will last for seasons. I might actually be on sale, but it's fully lined. It has two welt pockets. They're actually functional. My biggest pet peeve when it comes to coats is full pockets. That's what I know that it kind of makes the cheaper quality. You want to make sure that's cool. I love putting my hands in it. I'm not sure if you guys do, but it just keeps you guys warm. I'm always cold. All the way I live in LA, I always joke and I said that I wish I could live in a different season in a different place because my obsession with coats is you guys unreal and I wish I could wear a coat different day. When it's winter in LA for like a month, I just want to layer them all on. <laughs> but then I'd look ridiculous. It is lightly padded. It has a little bit of padding and the sleeves are slightly fitted. So when I was looking this up, you can order size down because it is a little bit big, but this is menswear inspired. What made this jacket really cool and unique than most camel coats is that the front placket is closed. If you look, it's a hidden placket. I'm gonna hide my face to show you guys. You really can't see the buttons and I thought that that was more of a polished look. More menswear coats have this look, so that's what made it more tailored and more feminine too. And it, it's like a different edge to a feminine coat. I really like it. Ignore that. <laughs> I 
But if you're looking for a camel coat, I'll link three, three or like a little bit, like two or three for you guys. And then if I'll link this one as well, this is a staple piece. I love Toro's buttons. I mean, this is like if you're a camel coat staple. Oh, we're rolling? Yeah. Oh. As we start to film you guys, by the way, we're getting used to each other. I'm going to bring the cameraman because it is Romel. I'm going to force him out of the background because if you guys hear our jokes, I'm clumsy. I ramble 100 million times an hour and he's behind the camera going, slow it down. So bear with me as I get used to this. But let's jump into quote number three. Now, the season's hottest item right now that everybody thinks is the best thing, and I agree, is the teddy coats. Some call it the plush coats, some call it fleece coats, faux shirling, Romel calls it sheep sheep, cotton ball on Instagram stories. This is an olive green one, and these guys come now in tobacco colors, camel colors, beige colors, I mean, they are everywhere in different price points. I grabbed this from Zara. And I was obsessed with how thick and chunky it was for like, warmer, what, what, let's say warmer weather. I'm definitely not wearing this in warmer weather. In colder weather, I liked how long it was and that how the collar was really high. But my biggest pet peeve when the faux shirling is I want to make sure that the yarns are not too long. What I mean is you don't want to look like a rug or a bath towel. I mean, this does look like I just rolled out of bed. But cozy look yet chic and the fleece jacket on this with a plush, it's really short so what it does, it makes it look a little bit more polished. I really love this olive color. It was different than the camel one. I have too many camel staples. I wanted to add a little bit of a flair to a black outfit and this one was a really nice one. It has two big pockets and two big buttons. It is 100% polyester. I want to say it was about $100. I got it on a Black Friday 20% off. But something like this is where I'll invest in polyester, which is a man-made synthetic fiber. This is a fashion item and not so much a classic staple, although this has been in two seasons. So if you're looking to grab something, a high fashion street version at Zara might be your best bet. Or Topshop or ASOS has really great versions as well. This one, I'll be rocking it. If you guys want to know where I saw these videos as well, if you haven't seen, I will keep telling you guys that like my Instagram handle will be on the bottom. Make sure you check it out. I'll be selling each item differently as well. Let's jump into coat number four. I hasn't even made too many coats, but I just recently got this. I haven't even worn it. Still got the tags on it. I saw it at the Free People store on the mannequin. Knew I had to have it. Full fur. Full fur is absolutely one of my favorite things when it comes to winter. It looks so plush. You guys, this looks like absolute butter. If you touch it, it just feels so amazing. I wish you could sleep in it. This one is more of an oversized fit. I got it from Free People. I loved how boxy it was. I will tell you guys though, when I did wear it, I tried it in a small, in an extra small, I sized down and it's still oversized. So if you are looking for your size, make sure you size down because it's still a bit boxy fit. It is fully lined. The quality, and has more of a boxy sleeves as well. It's just a beautiful faux fur. It looks beautiful. The color comes in four different versions. I liked how it made me like on a black outfit. It just dresses up an outfit and I just want to look like I felt in pages and I just went outside and I just wore it. Can't wait to style this guy. <laughs> so the last thing I wanted to cover is the first one was black. Second one was camel. Then it was fleece jackets and faux fur. You want to add a pattern to your closet as well. All of the fashion item plaid always comes back every season. If you're looking for a plaid, classic plaids are in a navy, red, and neutrals. When I saw this jacket, it is more of a lightweight woven jacket. So it's not definitely, it's more of a fall jacket, but because our LA winters are considered lighter temperatures, this is something I could be wearing, but you might want to layer this on top of you're living in a really cold temperature. But this is a textured woven jacket. I liked how it felt. It is more of a, it is a bit big. So I did size down. This is an extra small. I did like the plaid pattern a lot. It is more of a neutral gray and black and white plaid. It's very popular for the season. This is something that you can start up. All the plaids come and go in different shapes and forms when it comes to sizes for fabrications. This is a season staple, so as far as a fashion item goes, if you're looking for a pattern, aside from the animal print that is trending, I really like this plaid one. I would style this with gray boots. You can even text use a textured boot, black outfit. It is just beautiful on, size down, and it is a lightweight coat. I love this one as well. 
And that's a wrap. <laughs> Thanks you guys for watching. Those are my five favorite quotes for winter. Super obsessed. If I can wear them all on top of each other, I probably would. Make sure you guys subscribe. I have so many more of these coming soon. I'm super excited. If there's anything you guys are interested in seeing right away, leave a comment. Give it a thumbs up. Until next time.